Hi, I'm Christ Brother. That's right, folks, I am Brother de Christos. Now, upon my first, uh, putting up my first two videos, I've noticed that I've gotten a little bit of criticism. Nothing really coherent, um, just a couple of people, one of them saying, uh, you're an idiot, uh, blah, 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 then he calls me Bub. Now, I'm familiar with a cartoon character um, by the name of Wolverine who uses the name Bub, so I gotta wonder, now, does this jackball calling me Bub consider himself some kind of X-Man? Uh, you know, is he sitting in his underwear? Uh, in front of his computer, going, Man, I'm an X-Me, yeah, uh-huh. Okay, whatever. Now, I know I'm being mean, but, you know, this, consider this an expression of my wrath, okay? Consider it an expression of my wrath. Now, I want to point some things out in regards to the system of belief. Now, this book that I have, uh, The Laws of Mind, then I have this other one, Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill, The Secret by Ronald, Rhonda Byrne, Byrne, I can't say that name. Anyway, um, you know, there's a few things that it's like I have all this wisdom, all this teaching, all this, all these concepts, spiritual, emotional, intellectual concepts, metaphysical concepts. I just want to throw them at you. But it's like I'm surrounded by people who they're, they're more than ready to swallow a whale whole, but yet I give them a little crumb, and they're like, oh my god, I can't get it down. Mm -hmm. Oh, give me some water. I gotta get it down. I can't. Oh. It's a little tiny crumb, and they're straining at it. They're straining at it. They're physically fucking straining at it. I don't get that. Now, I want to point out that, uh, you know, they, they're hoping to basically destroy my belief and destroy my faith. That's understandable. Because after all, you know, they're afraid. They're, they're so in love with their own limitations that the thought of somebody not being limited terrifies them. Absolutely fucking terrifies them. I know, I have such horrible language for a Christ. Now, you know, because this channel, this channel is for teaching. If you don't want to learn, if you just want to criticize and whine, then find some other channel to do it on. Because I don't have time for you. Seriously. I'm here for people who want to learn. If you don't want to learn, leave. Now, here's part of the teaching. And, you know, this book I'm quoting from a lot because you know, it's like ever so often the universe gives me books which just, they inspire me or they affirm what I already know to be true. And when a book tells me something that I already know to be true, I buy the book generally. Or if I need inspiration, I buy the book. Or if it, you know, if it gives me rational, logical arguments to my beliefs, I buy the book. And I try to comprehend it, I try to understand it, because I too am always learning. Now, hmm, true, quote, true faith is the union of your conscious and subconscious mind, scientifically directed. The most potent forces of nature act silently with no noise. By studying nature, we communicate with the infinite. Now, I want to point something out with that. You know, so many people think that if something changes, that there's going to be, you know, like they're watching some fucking episode of Charmed or some godforsaken little fucking Harry Potter, you know, little witchy fairy dust 
bullshit cartoon where anytime something changes, there's sounds and, and lights and sparklies and, you know, sounds of thunder and colors and swirly things going on. No, that doesn't happen because nature doesn't do that. Nature, the world, the universe, takes the easiest, simplest, quickest route possible. Water always runs downhill. Don't tell me. Don't. No, don't tell me, little. I. I know there are some places it runs uphill, but that's not the point of what I'm trying. What I'm trying to say is that you've got to have faith in yourself. I have faith in myself. I have faith in the universe. I have faith in the infinite. And I'm not going to let myself be dragged down by a bunch of people who are limited in their thinking, limited in their, in their understanding, limited in every conceivable and inconceivable way. Because you know what? The universe is not limited. It's limitless. The subconscious is limitless. And you know what? So am I. So to all you faithless fucks, find another channel. Find another person to mess with. Because I, Bravo de Christos, will shatter your delusions. Will shatter your limited thinking. Have a day.